Hello, people of the internet. My name is Johnny, and welcome to an update on the FNAF AR Special Delivery teaser image. If you guys aren't aware, Illumix has been tweeting out a, uh, a select portion of this gigantic teaser for the AR game, and every day they release a new portion of it, like I just said. And so it's been a little bit since we first looked at it, so I thought, hey, it's almost there, like a few more days to go. I think by the end of this week, it'll be done. And that's probably when the demo is going to come out. So we're stopping like midway here, even though it's not really midway, but you you'll see when, when we get there. But we're stopping about midway to just check in on the image, see how it's doing, see all the new stuff that has been teased, which there are a few new stuff, which is really interesting. Some of it, actually most of it, we already knew was going to be in the game, but uh, there are, like I just said, a few new things that we can take a look at, speculate on, and there is also a few things that aren't entirely clear what they mean. So again, we're gonna talk about that, and at the end, I'm gonna show you all a huge collection of the pieces put together. <laughs> Little FNAF 4 reference there, I did not actually mean that. Of all the images so far put together, um, just so you guys can see what it will kind of look like when it's all finished, like I said, uh, around the end of this week. So, let's start off, um, it started on November 11th, so we're gonna go day by day, <laughs> we're gonna look at them, and then at the end, we're gonna look at them all in their entirety. So, November 11th, Let's start there. Actually, we already theorized about this one. We did a whole video dedicated to it, so if you haven't seen that, it'll be linked down below and it'll be up in the iCard up out there. Um, but just in case you haven't seen it, here it is. It's been on screen uh, while I've been talking for a little bit. But again, we already looked at this, so link in the description. Let's move on to November 12th. Expect a lot of these teasers to just be something simple like this. And while they don't mean anything by themselves, when they're put together into the whole image, they will mean something. So, like I just said, this was the image released on the 12th of November. It shows a little bit extra of Baby's um, right arm and hand there, and then there's also a foot down in the bottom left hand corner. Um, uh, later on, we will figure out who that is. Just based off of the foot alone, you should be able to tell who it is. And if you are up to date, you, you actually do know who it is. But there's really not much else to say. They're on a road, it looks like, because of the whole um, gravelly cement of the ground. And then there's a sewer drain leading into the sewer, obviously, and then a sidewalk along a building with what well, looks like barred windows, which is really interesting. And then a brick outside material, so not entirely sure what that location could be, but I guess we're gonna find out in the game. Moving on to November the 13th, this one is a very, very simple one. All it is really is just the logo. Nothing we haven't seen before, but there is something to take note of, is, and that is um, just to the left of the <laughs> of the logo, you can actually see what looks like a security camera. So, we, we're not entirely sure if this is going to serve any purpose, because as we know so far, all we do is we see the characters coming towards us, and then we shock them to get rid of them. That's all we know. Uh, we don't know if there's going to be like an actual FNAF section where we're looking at security cameras around our house. Wait, that would actually be super cool. That would actually be really, really cool. I don't know how you would set it up, but that idea is really, really cool. So, uh, yeah, I, I think that would be awesome. I don't think it's gonna happen, though, but that would be awesome. November the 14th, we get Baby's Foot, and that's really it. We get the other side of the road, um, and it's just more sidewalks um, in front of buildings, and this one has notably less windows, which is interesting, but... Yeah, it's, it's still a building, so moving on to the 15th. Like I said, expect a lot of these to just be tiny little snippets of information, so 15th. And every once in a while, you get images like this, which really just grab your attention. Because not only do we get 
um, the rest of Baby's uh, face and her hand. We also see Plush Trap hanging out on the fire escape. Uh, we have seen him, so we know he's going to be in here. And then we also see Mr. Cupcake hiding up in the window. Now, I'm guessing that Chica's up there as well, we just don't really see much of her. But um, the Cupcake is definitely there, and we did know that Chica and the Cupcake were going to be in the game, so... This is a really cool image, it's just there's nothing new, so uh, yeah. Uh, there's the 15th, moving on to the 16th. This one, I honestly think is the most interesting one that we've seen so far, as of recording this on the 18th. So, this is the 16th one, and we can see a, uh, a ear poking out from the bottom of the screen. We'll get to that one very, very shortly uh, as to who that character is, but like I said, you should know who that is already. But we actually see an a Endo-01 endoskeleton in the window. Um, as far as I'm aware, we didn't know that they were going to be in the game, but we do know now. Um, I'm not sure if Endo-02 will make an appearance, but we definitely know that 01 will. And then we also see an Illuminix poster. Um, I don't really know what to think of that. Maybe we're dealing with another meta game where um, Illuminix, the company that made Special Delivery, is also in, um, what's it called? Uh, special Delivery, uh, like we had with FNAF VR, where Scott, well, we now know that it wasn't actually Scott, but the games, the FNAF games, were canon in the FNAF lore. It's really weird, and I don't like to talk about it just because it confuses me so much, and I don't want to give off any false information, because I honestly don't know what, <laughs> what I'm talking about when it comes to, uh, meta stuff like that with the FNAF franchise, so interesting to take note, Illuminix is in the game, or at least in a teaser for the game. On the 17th, we get Foxy and Baby holding hands, I know, I, it's, it's clearly Foxy, you guys should know by now from these teasers that it's Foxy, and if you didn't, then the 18 literally straight up confirms it. I honestly really, really, really love Foxy's pose in this image, I just, I don't know, I just love it so, so much. So, uh, yeah, we get Sans Foxy with his glowing blue eye, and then we also get someone in the window staring at Foxy. I'm not entirely sure who that is. Um, I think some people were speculating that it was Springtrap, though uh, I don't think it has been confirmed. This, this teaser was only posted two hours ago, so it's pretty new, and not many people have really figured out exactly what's going on in it. Uh, let me take a look at the comments. Some people are saying it's Freddy, some people are saying it's Springtrap. Um, most people are just talking about Sans Foxy though. And this is the most up-to-date, uh, full picture of the teaser that we have. Again, this is on the 18th, so anything that's been posted on the 19th and in the future is not going to be on here, just because it hasn't happened yet. I do definitely think that we're going to get another character over on the right hand side. Uh, it's also going to finish off the ground at the very bottom, and then also finish off Baby uh, in the middle. Who is going to be on the right? I don't entirely know. It could be Bonnie, because we have not seen him. could be Freddy, because we have not seen him. Um, it could be Springtrap, because we know he's in the game, but we haven't seen him um, in this teaser at all yet. It could be an entirely new character, it could be someone that we know of that just isn't in the game, um, as far as we know of. Who knows? It really could be anyone. <laughs> Honestly, it feels like Custom Night all over again, where anyone is up for debate, I don't know. Based off of this teaser as well, you can take a guess on how many more days are going to be in it. Uh, let's see, so there's probably going to be one up top to finish off Baby's face, and then maybe like two in the middle, uh, maybe two at the bottom as well, and then maybe two at the uh, two or three at the right side as well to finish off the entirety of that image. So that's what maybe like seven ish more days. I don't know, um, but it is coming out before Thanksgiving, and Thanksgiving is on the 28th. So we do have a kind of release date for it. All we know is that it's going to be um, releasing between now and the 28th, which is in exactly 10 day so expect it to come out within um that time frame i guess there's really not much to say it's kind of self-explanatory um and we've done loads of other theory videos and analysis videos on this in the past from the trailer to the email that illumix um sent out to all other stuff they've released quite a few things like the snapchat filter um 
I think they did they have two trailers they had like three three trailers which is just incredible for one game <laughs> it's really a first for the franchise and I really cannot wait for this AR game because um, as you guys may or may not have know, known um, Minecraft Earth just released and it is an interesting game definitely does give me that uh, Pokemon Go feel vibes um, I honestly really hope FNAF AR doesn't give me Pokemon Go vibes just because so many people are aware of Pokemon Go and so many people have played it that I feel like I really really want Special Delivery to do something really unique because that's the thing that um, FNAF has been known for you know going out of the comfort zone uh, switching up the FNAF algorithm with a sister location FNAF world uh, more recently help wanted so I really really hope they do something unique that nobody has seen before in an AR game and uh, yeah I just really can't wait so mark your calendars before Thanksgiving hopefully we get a release date soon but um, that's really it for the updates so thanks everyone for watching and I'll see you all on the flip side goodbye